about the day that I was literally scared to death, really. So uh, I was living in Mexico. I had been there for six years. So I was what, 14. So when I got home, I would like go out and play all night until like 10, 11. It was really dark. So what we would do was play soccer. So we, we I called it street soccer because we literally played in the street. There was no like uh, court, um, like a field or no posts or anything. So we just grabbed a rock, another rock, another rock as the goals. So we just like, I don't think. So it was, what would I say? It was, I don't know, nice, you could say. So I would play with people above my age, like big, everything. So when you would play, they would actually like tackle you. You would fall on the floor and scrape all your knees, your legs. So it really hurt. So we, me and my friends didn't play with them. We played like with our age, like 14, you know, like around my age. So we would put the post, the goals on like post of electrical wires. So it was like in front of the house. So what would happen was that I would just play and it would go like that. <laughs> oh crap. I'm thinking, sorry. You're fine. Yeah. Nervous. Shit. Uh first time it happens. It's okay. You're playing soccer, what happened? Uh, I lost it. So we were playing soccer. So they passed me the ball and this Yep, I lost it. Uh, what happened? Wait, they wait, passed wait. you the ball. Yeah. Did you kick it? Yeah, I kicked it. <laughs> <laughs> so I kicked the ball, but when you swing it, my leg went kind of a little bit to the side. So the, the ball would actually went up. It went like a problem and went above my friend. So since the the, actually, the house was in front. I looked at my friend. He just saw the ball go like that. And I saw the ball go like that, too. So I'm like, oh my god, are you freaking kidding me? The worst part wasn't missing the actually scoring. The worst part was when you hear something break. So I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> I was really, really scared. Because, you know, when something breaks, like you don't have no money to pay for it. So who's going to pay for it? Obviously, your parents. So they would actually kill me because I actually broke something. <laughs> so I'm like, oh my god, I'm shaking. I'm like, should I run for it? it was like, <laughs> it's already dark. So I'm like, nobody saw me. My friends were like right there. So I'm like, we should run for it. But I'm like, oh crap, the ball, right? So when we would play, like when you actually have a soccer ball, it's actually, I don't know, really rare. So when you actually lose it, you have to pay for it. So I'm like, oh crap, but now I have to pay for the soccer ball. Because what happened was, I saw the ball and it broke a window. I'm like, oh damn. So the ball actually went inside the house. So I actually, I actually had to go get it. So I'm like shaking, me and my friends were like, what are we gonna do? I don't know. So I'm like, we should go actually go get the ball. So I'm like, they're like, oh, okay. So I'm like, we go, I go up shaking, I knock on the door, and this guy comes out. So he's like, he's old, not old, old, but like, I don't know, like, hairy man. So <laughs> he's a hairy man, and he's, he, he's like, he was looking like he was already asleep. So I'm like, uh, can we have the ball? And he, he's like, okay. He grabs it and he gives it to him, to us, I mean. And then he's like, you actually know that you actually guys broke a window? So I'm like, yeah, we know. So it's like, could we do something, fix it, talk, how are we gonna fix this? He's like, nah, nah, it's okay, don't worry. I'm like, no, are you serious? <laughs> like, I'm actually really scared here, are you serious? He's like, yeah, you know, I, I could fix it later. He's like, he was a guy that, you know, he took many jobs. He, we did any kind of job, like repairing, electrical, uh, construction. So he actually, I think he actually knew about that stuff. So I'm like, oh, okay. So we grab the ball and then we go. We're like in the street. We're like, 
So what do you guys want to do? Back your thing? <laughs> <laughs> They're like, nah, we just should go home. I'm like, okay, I go home. And you're like, when you actually do something bad, you actually tell your parents? I'm like, I'm not going to tell them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you.